session, I'm going to show you how to make an owl catch its prey using the arrow keys. Let's have a look. Please avoid the obstacle. So we go this way and up and then this way and we catch the prey. Wow, isn't that amazing? Let's get started. By default, you will see a cat sprite. Click on the cat and then click on the delete button. Below the canvas, you will see a box that says backdrop. Click on that. Then at the top, you will see three options, code, backdrop and shine. Click on backdrop. Then make use the line option to make four vertical lines and three horizontal lines. One vertical line, two vertical lines, three vertical lines and four vertical lines. Now let's do horizontal lines. One horizontal line, two horizontal lines and three horizontal lines. Now let's go to the choose spray option and search for owl. Place it in the very first block. After you've done that, go to the choose by option and search for food truck. Then change the size to the size that fits in your box. I'm going to go for 35. Then duplicate the food truck. Then move them inside appropriate boxes. At the top, you will see three options, code, costumes and sounds. Click on costumes. Then click on the second costume. Then go back to the code tab. Then go to the choose by option and search for building. Then change the size that fits in your box. I'm going to go for 45. Then duplicate the building. At the top you will see three options. Code, costumes and sounds. Click on costumes. Then choose the second costume. Now go back to the code tab. We have to get the owl spray, so go to the choose sprite option and search for grasshopper. Then change the size that fits in your box. I'm going to go for 45. Then move it inside the appropriate box. Time to code. Select the owl sprite. We want to make the program with arrow keys, so let's go to the events and take when space key is pressed. Select when up arrow is pressed. Go to the motion and take point in direction 90. Change the 90 to 0. Take move 10 steps. Go to the control and take the if block. Then go to the sensing and take touching color. Put the touching color on the if block. Click on the color. You will see a small pen. Click on that. Then take your mouse pointer and click on the buildings. Go to the sounds and take place sound until done. Place it inside the if block. You will see three options at the top. Code, costumes and sounds. Click on sounds. You will see an icon on the bottom left. Click on that. Go to the sounds and choose a short sound. I am going to pick a bass. Now let's choose a sound for the owl's bite. I am going to pick bite. Go back to the code tab. Now click on the arrows and choose your sound. 
Go to the control section and take stop all. Place it inside the if block. Stay in the control and take another if block. Go to the sensing and take touching color. Like we did before, click on the color and then you will click on the pen. Click on that. Move your mouse pointer and then click on the food truck. Go to the sounds and take play sound until done. Change the arrow to sound you had before. For me, it is a vast. Then go to the control and take stop all. Stay in the control and take another if block. Take touching color. Click on the color and then click on the pen. Take your mouse pointer and click on the grasshopper. Go to the sounds and take play sound until done. Choose the sound bite. Go to the control and take stop all. Stay in the control and take another if block. Go to the, go to the sensing and take touching color. Click on your color and then click on the pen. Take your mouse pointer and click on the other building. Go to the sounds and take play sound until done. Select the sound bus. Go to the control and take stop all. Duplicate these blocks three times for the other arrow keys. One time. Two times. And three times. Select the second one and select down arrow. Update point in direction to 180. Select the third one and select right arrow. Update in 90 direction. Select the last one, left arrow. Select update point in direction to minus 90. Now let's reset the owl's position every time we reset the game. Go to the events and drag and drop when green flag is clicked. Now let's go to the motions and take to X and Y coordinates. Attach it to when green flag is clicked. Then take point in direction 90. Now let's make it full screen and play the game we developed. Use the arrow keys to help the owl catch its prey. Please be careful and avoid the obstacles. Hooray! Well done friends. I hope you enjoyed this session. Don't forget to save the code by clicking on the file and then save to your computer. Please like, share and subscribe to our channel. Bye for now.